How to use Wells Fargo Online Banking Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to be discussing how we can use the Wells Fargo Online Banking to leverage our transactions. So make sure to watch the video till the very end. The very first thing you want to do is open up your browser, go to www.wellsfargo.com. As you go to the website, you're going to be able to see this type of interface. Now, in order to apply for online banking, you already need to have an existing bank account on Wells Fargo. You can also create your Wells Fargo bank account online or you can simply visit your nearest branch in order to create your Wells Fargo account. Online banking simply means being able to make transactions online without having your physical presence at the bank. Once you're on the website, the very first thing we're going to do is we're going to sign up. And in order to sign up, if you look on the bottom left hand side of the screen here, you have the sign on button if you already have an online banking account. But because we do not have it and we're just only getting started, we're going to just click this option over here that says enroll. So you want to make sure to just click that option. As you go to the enroll button on the next specific page, it is going to take you to this website over here where you'll be able to simply fill in a form. But as I mentioned before that you will need to have an existing bank account on Wells Fargo, which is why it is first of all going to ask me for my social security number. In case I do not have it, I'll just select I don't have this number. And what I can do is I can simply go ahead and then basically make sure to enter my card, loan or even my account number that I have of your Wells Fargo account. Once you've entered that, just click this continue button. It is going to ask you to simply enter your other details such as the credit or maybe debit card details it's going to ask you to enter the username that you would like to use as well as the password so that next time you can simply sign in and once you've enrolled for it you can simply sign into it by clicking the sign on now option as you can find over here basically what you will do it is going to take you to the login screen where you simply need to enter the username of your Wells Fargo bank account and then you simply need to enter the password that you are going to use in order to sign in in case you want to save the username and password you can click the save username and then click the sign on option here Otherwise, what you want to do is you can simply select this option called forgot username or password. Once you select that, you'll be asked to reset it. Once you're logged in, you can do many things via Wells Fargo website. That is that you can choose to make transactions, you can find your account and routing number whenever needed, you can check your credit score, you can apply for home loan because as you can see all of these options over here. So let's say you want to apply for a credit card, go to credit card options and just select the credit card that you would like to apply for. Select the option and then you should be able to apply for them. If you want to apply for a home loan, just hover your icon over the home loan tab. You can choose to buy a home, first time home buyers or maybe you want to refinance your mortgage or whatever else you prefer. If you'd like to add some of the payment methods such as card and all everything else will be inside of online banking once you sign into it you can also apply for a personal loan auto loans premier or education and tools if you scroll down you'll be able to see different types of options you can also actually basically get a plan to pay for your college and find a credit card for yourself as well and if you want though you can also actually download the wells fargo mobile application that is available both on your app store as well as a google play store on android if you want to actually make an appointment with the Wells Fargo customer care, you can just select this option called make an appointment here and select the city or zip state. If you want to find the nearest ATM and branches, you can select find a branch or find a location. Hope this video helped you guys as to how you can get started with online banking on Wells Fargo. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.